the fabric of reality, an illusion? We often picture the universe as a vast stage where the drama of stars, galaxies, and planets unfolds. This stage we call space-time, a smooth, continuous fabric woven from the threads of space and time. But what if this seemingly fundamental backdrop is nothing more than an illusion, a convenient construct that emerges from a deeper, more fundamental reality? Recent theoretical frameworks, grappling with the unification of general relativity and quantum mechanics suggest exactly that. Space-time as we know it, may not be a fundamental ingredient of the cosmos but rather an emergent property, arising from a deeper level of reality. Einstein's universe where gravity bends space and time. Our current understanding of the universe rests largely on two pillars, Einstein's theory of general relativity and quantum mechanics. These two theories, though seemingly disparate, together form the bedrock of modern physics. While general relativity governs the cosmos on a grand scale, quantum mechanics delves into the subatomic realm, explaining the behavior of particles at the smallest scales. The interplay between these two realms is a frontier of ongoing research, as scientists strive to unify them into a single coherent framework. General relativity, describing the universe on the grandest scales, paints a picture where gravity is not a force but a consequence of the curvature of space-time. Imagine space-time as a flexible fabric. When a massive object like a planet or a star is placed on this fabric, it causes a dent or a curve. This curvature then dictates the motion of other objects, much like how a marble would roll towards a bowling ball placed on a trampoline. Massive objects warp the fabric of space-time around them, much like a bowling ball placed on a trampoline. This warping effect is what we perceive as gravity. The more massive the object, the greater the curvature, and hence, the stronger the gravitational pull. This elegant idea revolutionized our understanding of gravity, moving away from the Newtonian concept of a force acting at a distance. This curvature dictates how objects move, explaining the dance of planets around stars and the very expansion of the universe. The planets orbit their stars not because they are being pulled by an invisible force, but because they are following the curved paths laid out by the warped space-time. This concept also extends to the entire universe, influencing the motion of galaxies and the overall structure of the cosmos. Einstein's famous equation, GMN plus LG men equals sign 8PGC4, T men, encapsulates this beautifully. This equation is a cornerstone of general relativity, succinctly relating the geometry of space-time to the distribution of matter and energy within it. It is a profound statement about the nature of our universe, linking the abstract mathematical world with the tangible physical reality. It relates the curvature of space-time, g mu nu, to the energy and momentum, t mu nu, present within it. In simpler terms, the equation tells us that the presence of matter and energy warps space-time, and this warping in turn affects the motion of matter and energy. This interplay is at the heart of many cosmic phenomena, from the orbits of planets to the bending of light around massive objects. This theory has been incredibly successful, predicting phenomena like gravitational lensing and black holes. Gravitational lensing occurs when light from a distant object is bent around a massive object like a galaxy or a black hole, creating a distorted or magnified image. Black holes, on the other hand, are regions of space-time where the curvature becomes so extreme that not even light can escape, and forming the foundation of our understanding of cosmology. From the Big Bang to the expansion of the universe, general relativity provides the framework for understanding the large-scale structure and evolution of the cosmos. It has opened up new vistas in our quest to comprehend the universe, guiding us in our exploration of the most profound mysteries of existence. The Quantum Realm, a world of uncertainty. This is a domain where the rules of classical physics no longer apply, and the behavior of particles defies our everyday experiences. Zooming into the microscopic world we encounter the perplexing realm of quantum mechanics. Unlike the predictable world we see around us the quantum world is full of surprises and mysteries. Here particles behave like waves existing in a superposition of states, their properties governed by probabilities rather than definite values. This means that until we measure them, particles can be in multiple places at once, or have multiple energies simultaneously. Heisenberg's uncertainty principle, delta x delta p, is greater than or equal to h over 4 pi, highlights this fundamental fuzziness. This principle tells us that the more precisely we know the position of a particle, the less precisely we can know its momentum, and vice versa. 
it states that we cannot simultaneously know both the position x and momentum p of a particle with perfect accuracy. This inherent uncertainty is not due to any flaws in our measurement tools, but a fundamental property of nature itself. This probabilistic nature of the quantum world clashes with the smooth, deterministic picture of space-time presented by general relativity. General relativity, formulated by Einstein, describes the force of gravity and the large-scale structure of the universe with incredible precision. At the event horizon of a black hole, or the very beginning of the universe, the two theories break down, leading to inconsistencies and seemingly nonsensical predictions. These extreme conditions push the limits of our understanding and reveal the need for a new, unified theory. This conflict suggests that one or both of these frameworks are incomplete, hinting at a deeper theory that can reconcile the two. Scientists are on a quest to find this elusive theory, often referred to as the theory of everything, which would seamlessly integrate the principles of quantum mechanics with those of general relativity, providing a comprehensive understanding of the universe. One of the most promising candidates for this theory of everything is M-theory. It proposes that our universe with its three spatial dimensions and one of time is not alone. Instead, it suggests the existence of higher dimensions curled up and hidden from our perception. Within this framework, elementary particles are no longer point-like objects but rather vibrations of tiny, multi-dimensional membranes called brains. These brains can have different dimensionalities, denoted by M2, M5, and so on. The interactions and configurations of these brains within the higher dimensional space are thought to give rise to the forces and particles we observe, including the very fabric of space-time itself. This suggests that space-time is not fundamental but rather emerges from the dynamics of these higher dimensional objects. Intriguingly, M-theory is closely related to the holographic principle, a mind-bending concept that suggests our universe is a hologram. This theory, which emerges from the realm of theoretical physics, proposes that all the information that makes up our 3D reality is actually stored on a 2D surface. Imagine a hologram on your credit card, which appears three-dimensional but is actually a flat image. Similarly, the holographic principle suggests that our entire universe might be a complex projection of information encoded on a distant, lower-dimensional boundary. Just like a hologram encodes a three-dimensional image on a two-dimensional surface, the holographic principle proposes that the information content of our universe might be encoded on a distant lower-dimensional boundary. This boundary could be thought of as a cosmic canvas where the intricate details of our universe are painted. The idea is that everything we experience in our three-dimensional world, from the smallest particles to the vast galaxies, is a projection from this two-dimensional surface. This implies that space-time, and everything within it, is an emergent phenomenon, projected from this fundamental holographic surface. In other words, the fabric of reality, including time and space, might not be as fundamental as we think. Instead, they could be emergent properties that arise from the underlying holographic information. This challenges our conventional understanding of the universe and suggests that what we perceive as reality is just a shadow of a deeper, more fundamental layer of existence. This idea, though radical, has profound implications. If true, it could revolutionize our understanding of the universe and our place within it. It suggests that the universe is not a standalone entity, but is deeply connected to this holographic boundary. This interconnectedness could have far-reaching consequences for fields ranging from quantum mechanics to cosmology, potentially offering new insights into the nature of black holes, the Big Bang, and even the fundamental forces of nature. It suggests that our perception of a smooth, continuous space-time might be an illusion, much like the illusion of depth in a hologram. When we look at a hologram, we see a three-dimensional image, but we know it's just a trick of light on a flat surface. Similarly, the smooth, continuous nature of space-time that we experience might be a perceptual illusion created by the underlying holographic information. This challenges our very notions of reality and forces us to reconsider what we know about the universe. The true nature of reality, according to this view, lies in the information encoded on the boundary, while space-time itself is just a convenient way for us to interpret and interact with this information. This perspective opens up new avenues for scientific exploration, as researchers strive to understand the fundamental nature of this boundary and the information it encodes. By studying this holographic surface, 
we might unlock new secrets about the universe, leading to breakthroughs in physics, cosmology, and beyond. The holographic principle invites us to look beyond the surface and explore the deeper, hidden layers of reality. A quote from Carlo Rovelli, The universe is not made of space-time, it is made of answers to quantum questions. Make sure to like, share, comment and subscribe for more mind-boggling videos.